So on our last one, we have this nice huge run, and you see how it's all leisure lines. So the best way to read something like this, if you encounter this, is to get your first get your left hand into that G pedal point. But we have G here, so we have a third below and a third below. So we have six and then four. So we have four, six, one, four, one, six, one, six, four, six, four, two. Four, two. So I'm reading more intervals. I'm not trying to see oh, is this an E or a B flat or a C. I'm just really kind of basing it off of this G here and then just going down in intervals. And it makes life a lot easier because a lot of people will look at that and be like, what's going on? So what you really want to do is just take this G and then just go off the intervals. So we have um, what? Four six one four six or one six four six four two four two then one one and then it's pretty much the same thing but up higher six seven two four two seven two seven five seven two four three two and then you do this nice one three five try it at the end so if we look at my actual hands as I do it, we have this nice low run. You can see that's all thirds. Then you end it with this nice one three five one triad. And that's Bach Prelude number one in G major.